hello, welcome. Take a moment, try this problem out, and then press play when you're ready to solve it with me. Okay, so it says solve the equation below and find the exact solution. Well, that's exciting, right? We've got logarithms with variables. And here I see a plus of two logarithms. And that could be rewritten as the log of x times x plus 1. And that's got to be equal to the log of 20. All right, cool. So this can only happen, right? The log of this can only equal the log of this when x times x plus 1 equals 20. So that's what we're dealing with here. When does x times x plus 1 equal 20? All right, well, I'm going to distribute my x. x times x is x squared times 1 is x. We have x squared plus x. Subtract 20 on both sides. And now I'm dealing with the quadratic. Factors that multiply a negative 20 but add to positive 1 are plus 5 and minus 4. So x could be negative 5 or x could be 4. I usually do recommend that you uh, attempt to plug these in and figure out what's going on. So for example, right here, I know I can't use negative 5 because negative 5 plus 1 is a negative number in the domain uh, of a logarithm, right? And for this log, at least, is where x has to be um, bigger than negative 1, right? Because this, this, this sum right here can't be 0 or smaller. So in that case, uh, the only answer that has a potential of working is 4. And you might take a moment and plug that in and just verify that the log of 4 plus the log of 4 plus 1 is really the log of 20. All right, hope that helped.